And now are we off to the right or are we off to the left? Sitting in the cab of a forklift. Keep going. 17-year-old Felipe Cervantes is opting for a career path that doesn't include college. It's not just college that can make you successful, but uh, other, other things. But this isn't a private vocational school. It's Patterson High School, where students learn job skills they can use right when they graduate. So they're coming out of, of uh, high school with a work, with, literally with our industry partners wanting to hire us full-time benefits, uh, medical, dental, 401k. Here, it's not just math and science, but courses like forklift safety, not only behind the wheel. Students are also taught how to use the forklift through virtual reality with these headsets. Don't run nobody over. So today's lesson, the work lead lesson, was called entering and exiting the cab. There's also a commercial truck driving class. And I like how you used all the steps. You're not trying to skip a step. Dave Dine is a former trucker and elementary school teacher. He initiated the class five years ago. This is already loose. And has students moving on to truck driving school. How do we kind of feed the pipeline? And that's one reason uh, these programs are so important is to create that, that sustainable, sustainable pipeline of, of, of young new talent. 17-year-old Savannah Martinez wants to use her trucker class skills as a stepping stone to become a psychiatrist. I feel like it'll actually help pay my way through college because college is expensive. And if that's not enough, the school also has its own realistic logistics warehouse. So we teach the fundamentals of a warehouse, which is receiving, put away, picking, and shipping. In its 10 years of Patterson High School providing the classes, many other schools from across the country have wanted to duplicate the Patterson program. So what are you going to do? No doubt it's providing a lift to the supply chain problem.